this works? Sort of. Maybe. Probably I'm not supposed to film in front of a window, but I was going to film over there, but I don't have enough room, so I have to move things. And I'm not doing that right now. Hey guys, it's Maddie, and if you're thinking of filming a back to school series of stories and hauls and stuff like that, like supplies, there's a glare, but and both because I like watching both and stuff, so like I don't know, I just think it'll be cool. So anyway. This is going to be my first video, and it's going to have things to do with school and stuff. So this happened around when I was like in first grade, I want to say. And it's like early first grade, okay? Because I know this because it was like hot outside and stuff. And there was this boy. And I really, really liked him. So we're going to call him John. Now his name is not John though. And now, I liked John for a really long time. Like everywhere. I would play with him. I would try to get him. Okay, I liked him in kindergarten too and first grade. Even a little bit after that too, like to like about like in, in the school year from first grade. The point is, I liked him for a really long time. Somehow, he controls me. He convinces me that it is a good idea to skip class and stay outside on the playground and play with him. And I was like, Psh, yeah, like totally. Like I can do that. I'm great. Like that's fun. Only for you, like only for you, babe. Honestly, I don't know why, because no offense if he's like watching this or something, he probably isn't, but like he wasn't that cute and he, he was a really mean kid and I mean, we're kindergartners so of course you're going to be mean, but anyway, I really liked him. And so I play with him and stuff and I try getting him to like me or something, so we're out on the playground, everything's fine, it's recess, it's fun. And he turns to me and goes, Hey, do you want to stay out here with me? And I was like, What? What do you mean? Like, we have to go in. Recess is done. We have to go in and have class now. Like, what do you mean? And he's like, No, we can just like stay out here. And so and I'm like, Uh, I don't think this is like legal, but like, like, eh, that was my thought process. And so and he's like, We can stay out here. Like, don't you want to stay out here with me? And stuff like that. And I was like, Yes. This is it. This is how I get him to like me. This is how I prove my worth. And so I say yes. And I'm like, but what are we going to do if they see us? And so now, I don't know if you have this in your playground, but in our playground, it had like this like set of like things to play on. And then this one part, it's like down at the bottom. And it's like a circle. And it was like in the shape of a line, but like you could go inside and nobody would see you. So we hid in there. And like we. We sat in there and waited until everybody lined up and got inside, which took a while. They're like, they did head count, but they didn't see us for some reason. So we're in there waiting, and then we get out and stuff, and we're like talking for a little bit and stuff. He's like, and I'm like, well, I don't think this is such a good idea. Like, we should probably go in because we'll get in less trouble if we like go in like earlier and stuff. He was like, but why? Like, don't you want to play or something? I'm like, but then they'll see us, and I don't want to get in trouble. And I was like. The longer we were out there, the more I was like, this is wrong, this is wrong, this is not good, you should not do this. So finally I convinced him to go inside. And I don't know where exactly we went, I don't remember. I think somebody called us or something. So anyway, she catches me and we're going in this room and I'm like sitting across from her. And by her, I mean like the assistant principal. So I'm sitting across from her and she's like, I want to tell your parents what's going on, like what you did. like." You know what you did is wrong, and I'm over here freaking out. I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Like, please don't tell my parents. I don't want them to know. Like, stop. And she's like, okay, I'll let you go this time. But next time, it's not going to be that way. And I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm never going to do it. I'm never going to do it again. Like, oh my gosh, she made me do it. Okay, I didn't say that, but like, I was the one who decided to actually do that. Like, I knew that, so. But the gist of it was like, dude. And this story, oh my gosh, I did not tell my parents this story until like last year. Like last year. And this happened in like first grade because I was like, I'm a good kid. I'm a good kid. I never did anything wrong. Don't. I'm a good kid. And they didn't figure it out until like just recently when I told them, laughing. And it wasn't even a problem for them. Like they like 
thought it was funny that this happened too. So it's like, yeah. If you are new to this channel and like me, you should subscribe. But if you don't like me, you can like leave. Because why would I want you around if you, you didn't like me? So anyway, I'm... Hey guys, thank you for watching the video. I hope you liked it. So, come back for the next one. I think. Bye!